And then you wrestled Danny at Cage of Death that year, too. Mm. Better Nails. <laughs> what happened? Uh, I believe it was a back body drop, and my foot gets stuck and impaled in the bed of nails. Um, pretty, pretty, pretty crazy. Yeah, you're I, so... I lifted my leg up, foot up, and along came the bed of nails with it. And uh, I think it definitely uh, added to the match. Um, looking back on it now, uh, you know, st still kind of being green at the time, I would have sold the foot a lot better. Um, and I think a lot of the match would have revolved around my foot a little bit more, um, watching that back now. Um, but I, I think it definitely helped. You know, it was definitely, uh, I think that was like kind of like first memorable deathmatch moment I had. Like, oh, I remember when, you know, Tremont's foot went through the bed of nails. Um, but I think that at that time, you know, Cage of Death's the big show. You know, I'm, I've been in the company six months. I'm on Cage of Death. I'm wrestling Danny Havoc, one of the best, in one of the, you know, marquee non-death matches that's not the cage. And we tore it up. And I think at that point in time, that was one of my best matches uh, that I had. And uh, yeah, the better nails incident, you know, I think definitely added to it. I, like I said, if I looking back on it now, I, I think I just would have sold the foot a little bit more. Have it going up. No, Draymond, no, no, no. 